Hey everybody, it's Michelle with Michelle's Frugal Living and thanks for watching my videos and welcome to my new subscribers. Feel free to leave comments and ask questions. Okay, a little more Rite Aid today. Three days in a row. Wasn't going to do this anymore, but here I am because um, I guess they're giving us too much stuff this week for free. Money maker. Okay. Um, if you haven't heard yet, the summer items have gone to 75 off clearance. There's some good deals in there. Um, if you can find anything left at your store. The only thing I picked up in that is this uh, bouncy ball right here. I got that for $1.24 for my nephew. Um, anyways, yeah, I'll probably pick some stuff up. I, you know, I just wasn't, I was focused on other things today. So um, I did pick up a few new things. Um, let me tell you about this the tape. Um, if you saw this tape deal, I, I saw it on Island Coupon Gals video today. Um, the up rewards that it produces have got to be monthly up rewards that probably belong to August. And they were screwed up for some reason because you know you could buy two and get or buy one and get two one dollar up rewards. I bought two. I didn't you know they come out free because they're on half price and um I used this 25 cent coupon, and then I ended up getting um, two one dollar up rewards back. I don't know what the limit is. That's why I bought two. I thought I'd see, but then I think there's two up reward deals overlapping each other. So maybe one of them belongs to September and just went ahead and went started. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is on that. That's a, it's very strange. So, um, anyways, that like I said, it probably ended today on the fourth. Okay. Um, and I've got some Sandy hands. Um, these are in the hand sanitizing aisle, and there's a, a weekly uh, single check rebate back on these. It's two ninety nine single check rebate. You pay two ninety nine and you get it right back. Um, no up rewards on that. Limit one per card on that deal. Okay, and so let me show you a transaction um, that was a moneymaker transaction for me right here. And um, percentage-wise, it could have been better if I hadn't bought this ball and one of the scotch tapes. Um, so what I bought in this transaction was the ball, um, the Labella hair gel, which the dollar monthly on that ends today also. And um, people are reporting that you can buy, even though the, the ad says limit one and it's got like Aquanet and Prel uh, shampoo and some other stuff in there, um, people are saying they can buy one of each of the items in that deal and still get the up the $2 up reward, okay? So I, I haven't tried it, um, but that's what people are saying. I got these two um, scotch tapes. I got four carefree and four nail polishes and I used four of the carefree coupons and two of these uh, scotch tape coupons. That's all I used in that transaction except my upper rewards. So here we are. There's the ball, the tape, uh, the labella, the coupons. I used um, $12.50 in coupons, I mean in upper rewards. And um, there's the Carefree and the nail files. I paid 21 cents out of pocket and I got 15 back. So um, even with um, throwing in the tape that it you know, didn't need in this ball, um, it still was a money making deal. There they are. Okay. So um, just as another idea of a transaction. Okay. Um, let's see. Um, physician formula. I've never <laughs> bought <laughs> in in all the deals that they've had on physician formula in my years year couponing. I have never bought the um, physician's formula, and I decided to go for it today. And I thought the only way I was going to do it is if I found boxes with peelies on them. And I went to the first store, and the only thing I found were these two. And this one had a $3 peely on it, and this one had a $2 peely on it. And um, that's the only peelies I found at that store. So I went ahead and bought those. I also used two $5 um, Rite Aid printable coupons that came in the email. I did receive that email. Um, the link is out on the Internet so that you can... Um, print it as well. The coupons are one use coupons only. The barcodes are individual. It's that same deal. I talked about it last week 
where you have to go, you know, if you're in Google or use Firefox, you can go into an incognito window, change the email address up in the in the URL, and then print another one. Close the um, incognito window and um, open another one back up and do it again, but change the email address. Otherwise, the coupons will not scan a second time because um, you need to generate a new coupon off of a new email address every time you print that. Okay. So I had only printed four of the $5 coupons today and because um, I, didn't, I didn't have any clue how many uh, peelies I might find on these. And people were buying four like this and doing the deal twice, which is spend 20 and get a, seven, a $7 upper award, and you can do it two times. They were buying four. So I printed four coupons thinking maybe that would just be it. Well, I got these, but um, they're less expensive and then when I went to the second store, I found this, which actually you could just buy five of these at a, on a gold discount. Well, that's subjective. You'd have to do five singles, okay, because these I bought, I ended up just buying three. They're also buy one, get one half off this week. So if you bought five of, you know, bought these and, you know, two of them in the same transaction, then one of them's going to be half price. You'd have to buy more. Um I was just looking for something to round out this deal. This added up to like $18 and something. And then um, this one is actually retails for $5.50 with my gold discount because I bought one. It gave me my gold discount. You know, if you buy two in a, in a buy one, get one half off or a BOGO sale, you don't get your discount. So it came out to be 440 and I used the $5 coupon on it. So I used three of my $5 coupons right here on these, and I got my $7 up reward, and this is what that deal looked like, okay? And um, so I paid 282 and got $7. Now, while I was at my second store, I found, and I actually found one other item, like another one of these that had $3 peelies. These all had $3 peelies, but I only had one more $5 coupon to use. So I paid a lot out of pocket, um, like $24 out of pocket to get these other ones. But, and then I did the deal two times. Here's what it looks like. If you have all the, all, you know, four of the $5 coupons and then three peelies, three four $3 peelies. So eight eighty four out of pocket and get $14 back. Now, um, my store around here, they'll do post coupons, so I'm going to print three more coupons tomorrow, and I'll take them over to the store, and they'll give me my $15 back for that. Okay? Um, I think that's all I can talk about right now. I'll catch you guys later.